What about what? you, mate? These Bucks parties aren't healthy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you say no to a Bucks party? No, I mean, no not morally, no. Oh, gee. Yeah, you can't. And you can't not perform, um, <laughs> which is what happened at one of them. Last year. We went to, um, speaking of Bucks parties, mate, We one of my good mates, Gom, I just got, uh, he's getting married soon. And we went to the races out at um, Yarra Glen, I think it was. And it was, it was 35 degrees heat. Jeez. Um, but we went out the night before as well. So this, is, this, this is, is day night, two? This is the night we caught up for a beer at Middle Park. So that, wait, let's explain this. Because when we caught up, you were rolling in for a, it was supposed to be a, a friendly dinner. Yeah, it get together. Boys are flying in from... And know. then the next day was Saturday, well, which was the main day, the main crack. Yeah, the first night fever <laughs> kicked in, mate. <laughs> oh, it always happens. Mate, you go, you're going to go hard tonight. I said, no chance. Oh, it always happens. You can't. Oh, you... we had a monster. And then... um. Mate, the next day, 35 degrees. I reckon I had very little sleep and it was a tough day at the Yarra Glen races, mate. It was so hot. Wasn't there was footage on one of your stories of like running races or something and it looked to be like a oh. serious concussion of some sort to yeah, one of the yeah. blokes on the bucks yeah. or something. Well, our buck was, I think he had, he had heat stroke, mate. <laughs> <laughs> we are pouring cold water and he's, I think he had too many beers early. He was gone. But they, what they did was they, um, they organized, there was about 10 bucks parties and hens parties, I think going on and they organized a sprint Yeah, and uh, they lined all the, all the people that are obviously getting married up. And is this like, have you guys I've just got, created this at the races? Or someone like, else has, someone else has, and I've seen it and I'll go, this is going to be full on. It was a good 80 meter sprint, maybe a hundred, oh, called a hundred. hamstring territory. Yeah. Ha hammy, yeah. Hammy's knees. You what? Anyway, I'm watching this guy. He's dressed up in, um, in Collingwood outfit. And uh, I've actually got the footage, so I'll flick it to you. <laughs> oh, please and, do. Mate, they're <laughs> anyway, they've gone on your mark, set, go, and bodies and arms are flying everywhere. <laughs> and this bloke's like, you know when you're trying too hard, you over-rotate? And he's over-rotated, <laughs> and he's, he's hit his head on the ground, and the bloke behind him's trying to dump, jump in the air and, and hurdle him. And as he's going to hurdle him, he's landed on his temple and just squished his head into the ground. Oh, anyway, and we didn't really see it. And because I filmed it, I was like, what's this bloke's carrying on a bit, isn't he? Like, he's only, like, if you've done a hammy, he's on the ground for a good five minutes, right? Oh, so he's gone. Gone. I go, geez. And anyway, everyone's getting around him. And then he slowly makes his way back to his feet. And everyone was quite glad. I thought he literally did his hammy off the bone. I've looked at the footage. He has been seriously concussed, mate. <laughs> oh, so he's concussed. The bloke behind him has stood on his head like... <laughs> Oh, I'll have to send it to you. So big shout out to anyone that organizes them. They are a great laugh.